Students say they cringe when given homework involving the internet. That's because more than 50 percent of families at Lincoln High School in Jersey City don't have connectivity in their homes. People take for granted that uh, families have it and they really don't. And so this program is going to make sure that we're fulfilling that. Jersey On, a new statewide nonprofit, is helping students in low-income areas get hooked up. For a $40 flat fee, they get a lifetime of one gigabyte of broadband per month. Before I would have to, you know, take textbooks home or come in earlier or stay late after school or come in during my lunchtime. So it'll be a lot easier and more convenient. It's simple. If you can't afford the book or if you can't afford, in today's world, the Internet, <coughs> then you can't get the information. You can't fully learn and expand your horizons, horizons, and you can't compete with the rest of your classmates who may be fortunate enough to have that very same access. The founders of Jersey On say they recognized a growing need and wanted to level the playing field. If you get connected, the stats are incredible. You have a 7% higher chance of graduating high school, according to the Federal Reserve. Especially here in New Jersey, according to new data from the Census Report, New Jersey's poverty rates increased in 2013 to 11.4%. The survey showed Cumberland County had the highest in the state with 20.6%, followed by Hudson at 197 Students are eligible if their families meet the requirements for the free or reduced price lunch program. The initiative is being rolled out here in Jersey City, but there's already plans to take it statewide. We sent a letter to, uh, a couple weeks ago to every superintendent across the state, and we've heard from dozens already calling and said, when can we bring it here. The nonprofit is partnering with local internet providers to make it happen. They'll also provide refurbished computers around two years old for $200. That one gigabyte will get you about 102 hours of web page viewing, 465 minutes of video streaming, almost 50,000 emails sent and received, and about 13 hours of Skype time. That's giving them the preparation skills they need to prepare for college or to enter in the workforce. It's estimated some 800,000 New Jersey students will be eligible to take part in the program. In Jersey City, I'm Brianna Venosi, NJTV News.